When your pet needs urgent care, you need animal emergency care. Staffed with caring veterinary professionals with a state-of-the-art facility. Open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week for emergencies only. Animal Emergency Care in Bellingham and online at animalemergencycare.net. It's Critter Day, and we got something unusual for you today. In fact, this might be a first, and that's saying something, because we've done this for a long time. Yeah, this show has definitely gone to the birds. We've been saying there that for is. years. There's the dad joke, <laughs> and there's the bird. Laura Clark from the Whatcom Humane Society. Hi. Good morning. You guys are all being so good with the bird today, too. Thank you. I don't know. Very he's all pretty. fluffed up. He's so awesome. His name is Kramer. And he is a cockatiel. He's about five years old. He's so incredibly social. A lot of birds we get at the Whatcom Humane Society are fairly traumatized. They don't really want to be held. They're, they haven't been handled, which birds in captivity make me sad, but it's the reality. And so if you're going to have one, you need to interact with it. These are not animals that you just sit in a cage and stare at. They want to yeah. be close to the action. And this guy, forget about it. He's like a party. He seems very social. He's so social. He si- steps right up on your finger, Aww. which bird people love to see. And he will sit on your shoulder he is obsessed with jewelry and shiny things. So if you have earrings, I don't. But I have a necklace he's been obsessed with. He's, My wife's the same way. He sits, <laughs> he sits on our animal care staff shoulders during the day and picks at their their hats or their hair or their jewelry. And he's just, he's fantastic. So he's looking for a home that wants to engage with him and make him a part of the family. I love the big rosy cheeks. Mm-hmm. No, he's awesome. You want to hold him, Dave? Sure. What about other birds? Does it do... Do they get along with other birds? You know, they in the wild, they live in groups, uh-huh. and he has not, which also makes me sad. So oh. he's been kind of a solitary bird, but uh-huh. I think he would love a home with <laughs> other birds and a big aviary. <laughs> nice catch, oh, okay. Dave. Thank you. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi. So now it's a cockatiel, but it's not teal. How does that work? Uh, Mm. That's just the way it worked out. But he's super handsome. I love his speckled (laughs) colorings. Beautiful, yeah. (laughs) Yeah, so he would love a bird person, that, and they're out there. I know there's a cafe listener that's going, oh, my gosh, I love cockatiels, and I need to come Mm -hmm. get this guy. He would love a home that can provide him with his best life because that's what he needs. It's it's so beautiful and so colorful. It almost, the bird doesn't even look real. Yeah, he's cool. He yeah. Somebody needs to paint him. Mm. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Do all cockatiels look like this, have the same coloring? Similar coloring, okay. but he's very unique. That speckling coloring is yeah. very unique for him, for sure. And Alan, cool. you were very brave. You let him sit on your head, and he did not poop. So that, let's mm-hmm. give him kudos for that. Absolutely. <laughs> that's uh, that's very good. And uh, a little awkward having a bird on your head. I'm not going to lie. But uh, you know, it, more comfortable on Dave's head because there's more of a nest. <laughs> And he's five years old? He's five years old. Cockatiels, well cared for, can live up to 20 years. Okay. So he's just at the prime of yeah. his life right now. All right. Beautiful. He's very cool. Kramer's the perfect name, too, with that hairdo. It really is. Yeah. yeah. And he will, if you play videos of birds singing, and you can go on Aww. YouTube and like Google that, he bounces his head and totally gets into it. So Aww. I think he would love a home where there's just a lot of music and activity going on. Sure. So are you talking like kids, very kid-friendly and all that? Well, I mean, because he's so hand tame, I think he could go to a home with respectful kids. Um, I mean, toddlers might be a little much just because he he's fragile. He kind of matches your sweater. Oh, mm-hmm. yes. I try and color coordinate yeah. with the cafe nice. critters. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, he would love a family that's a bird friendly family. Gotcha. Okay. Well, Kramer available now for adoption at the Watkins Humane Society. Other birds? Um, right now we have some lovely turkeys. No Thanksgiving jokes, please. Wow. Okay. Um, but I think he might be our only small domestic bird. Okay. And then, of course, you have dogs and cats and gerbils and hamsters and... Yes, 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 and yes. Horses. Yes. Mm-hmm. Everything in between. <laughs> WalkumHumane.org. Laura Clark, thank you so much. Have a great week.